Welcome back. One of my favorite people in entertainment is here with me today. Sound Sultan. Oh my gosh. Legendary. How many years? How many years this year? Um, Which one? The football age or the... Uh, I didn't say your age in entertainment. I know. The football age of my <laughs> entertainment. <laughs> well, but I have a football age, honestly. Uh -huh. Is from the first release that people knew me. Yeah. When I blew. You know, people, they can play from when you blow. Yeah. <laughs> so it's 18 years. Before that, what was your other age? 24. So what were you doing then, before the blowing? Uh, you know hustle. Mm. You know hustle. Hustle. Hustle is the one I was doing. <laughs> so you had, you were just grinding. And... Yeah, I was grinding. You know, on the ground, doing my thing, following Baba D about. You know, <laughs> as a backup singer, and you know, just learning the ropes and just trying to, you know, gaining confidence. Because yeah. me, I was more of an introvert than just looking at like when this music thing. And that time, you know, the music never really show yourself saying go blow us. Yeah. So we're just like, okay, let's <laughs> you see. You were just this, doing it anyway. Let's see where this takes us, yeah. you know. And, you know, back then it was more, I was more of a rapper. You know, I used to rap. So that hip hop thing. And I started converting myself into a singer, you know. So all that was the time I used to board my, you know, not my muscle. <laughs> speaking, of, speaking, of, speaking of blowing and board mass, I mean, this song that we just saw now is basically almost defines your career. Yes. Sir. Do you sometimes just, it did not tire you? Like, no, at that time, you're just like, no, ah. no, no, I, you know, funny thing is, I, I'm so grateful to the song, because um, before that song, I had a song that was like my go-to song. You know, as, a, as an upcoming artist, mm -hmm. I'll just, when I get on any stage, I'll just do my song. That was the song, man. Gen -gen. Once I don't do that, gen -gen, you don't need to know me. You, you, you didn't need to even know anybody called Sound Sultan before you meet that guy on the stage, yeah. but you get wild somehow, some way, you know, because when you listen to the lyrics, you just, it's so self explanatory. Yeah. So at that point in time, it was gang gang. But when I wanted to release a song, you know, eh, eh, the one where they don't go ban immediately, you know. <laughs> so, and now I was on a tour on, on the road, I just wrote that song, and that was it for me. Yeah. You know, so that song, I felt like it didn't make me in front of people too much, for too long. Yeah. It was my first single, you know, and it did very still well. still a classic. I got an award for it last year. Amazing. Very well done. <laughs> <laughs> let's, let's talk about, I mean, your journey now. I mean, you're, you're, you're here today. You look at the industry. You've seen so many people come and go. Mm. Um, Tell me about it. <laughs> what would you say, I know it's a very cliche question, but what would you say has actually kept you? Because so, we know so many people who are not here anymore. I'm not saying they're dead, but I mean, they're not <laughs> in the industry anymore. Either not relevant or just completely um, left the industry. Yeah, well, um, I must say, I do not know that recipe. If I had known it, I would not misuse them. Yeah. <laughs> so it's, just a, it's not a trade secret. I just feel like you can put, place yourself in a certain position to acquire that blessing. Yeah. Um, but, you know, it's not something that you think you are the one that did it. Uh, but you have to always know that less is more. And for you to, you know, gain relevance, it has to be over a period of time. Mm -hmm. You know, it's subconscious in the mind of the people that you're trying to serve it. You don't force it on them. Don't rush it on them. Yeah. It's just something that you have to be tasteful. Because, I, I mean, you and, you and Two-Face are, I don't know, you, you have, I don't know if, in our heads, a lot of our heads, you guys are best friends. And you guys are one of the few who have actually continued to be consistent. Mm -hmm. So, I mean, if you guys are that close and are still, there must be something you guys are doing right. Yeah, well, it's, it's, <laughs> we, are, we find ourselves interesting. You know, we, we we share a lot of you know ideologies together. We we are funny people. We love making ourselves laugh. Even when people don't know, we just, you just DM me some kind of jokes that we can't even share. We don't <laughs> laugh. We do. So that's what keeps us you know going on together as friends. You know, and of course as family men now, our families are our families. You know. So yeah. besides that, you know, I just feel like why our personalities attract each other is because. You know, I mean, I, I, I really appreciate people that are down to earth. And yeah. I feel like that kind of opens doors for you. When you see people grinding at the top of the game for a long time, if you look at them, you see that, you know, they have a pinch of humility somewhere. You know, look at the likes of people that top their games. You know, if you look at the Kele Chiamadi you know, yeah. look at Alibaba, top. Jimmy Jack, you know, all these guys are grounded. You, they don't, you don't find yeah. any ounce of... Um, Do you find that that's different these days with the younger artists? You find that there's a lot of you know, a I, need to be exactly that. You see that's also, you, you see that's you that's are. where you were going with the need. You see, underlying need yeah. is like it's part of the recipe. If you don't if you don't put that in, in there somewhere, you know, somebody might just come and step on you. Or I don't know. I don't know why it is like that. They're not coexisting as you know, 
as they should, you know, many of them in front of the camera, yes, they do, but the the <laughs> green rooms are very cold now. <laughs> <laughs> green rooms are very cold. What I, sort I, of things have you seen in the green room? <laughs> <laughs> you know, that is like it's just left for someone like Lily to just start drawing, putting cordon, barricades, yeah. cordon off one area for one. that though? I, just, I mean, the industry is not even that big, is it? it? It's not that big, it, and everybody can eat, you know. But the thing is. You know, this ego thing, everybody's just trying to protect their ego. They feel like, okay, don't step on me. I don't want your bouncer to be my bouncer's bouncer. I don't want some, I want some bouncer to get bouncer. Some people with bouncer get bouncer. <laughs> you did there. <laughs> so I, I, I did. <laughs> sometimes, you know, somebody, yeah, somebody might just step on somebody's toe, you know, without the main people even seeing each other. You know, so it's always getting messy. Maybe... That's that's kind of thing that you know you mm. find when there's development anyway. Everything is getting yeah. better. The, maybe is that we, good? I, I mean, I mean, it's it's that's it, those are signs. I don't. They don't have to be good, but they are signs. Because uh, back then, maybe we say where they show one love, one love. If money can increase more, <laughs> the stakes are higher. Maybe we'll be too low. Maybe, uh, because that then, that time, eh, if one person was having a show, uh, platform boys would call this one up and say, okay, ah. This guy's having a show, oh, convoy. Everybody just blew convoy. Go for a show with them, they'll pay you. They backstage, all the chill with everybody, yeah, you know. So back then, was, the world love was real, and it was more, you know, closely knit. But now, like, everybody's checking out who, who's the next guy to, um, yeah. you know, cut their check. Or, Are you worried about the industry? Um, Are you excited about I'm it? I'm excited more, more than worried, you know. I'm excited because we have to be optimistic, um, you know, moving forward. I feel like... This wasn't, I, I never knew it was going to be at that level, at this level, this fast, you know, because we're talking like it's a decade and a half, yeah, you know, much. and <laughs> trust me, it's like Nigeria is the new, you know, I was thinking it was the new Jamaica, but it's now turning to the new America, the way it's going, you know, we're going about this music thing, it's yeah. going, spreading like wildfire, and I just feel like we just need to, um, what else, we need to just arrange our home first, yeah. because when they start seeing that, they will want to come here and see, ah, they will just see our... <laughs> so, imagine, <laughs> you understand? And then, can we really, like I wrote something, I said, walk, can we walk the talk? Yeah. You know, at the end of the day, you know, there has to be some value that comes with, say, the big box. When we start knocking on the big box, people want to see the value that you're bringing. It's not just the song that, okay, you sang that song on the CD, how can you perform it live, or what instruments yeah. do you play, well, how, how well can you hold a tour? You know, so all those things have to be yeah. arranged. And uh, when you look at the industry now, I mean, what do you think is probably the biggest um, issue you would want? I mean, I know we've talked a lot about mm -hmm. the, the big labels coming in. I don't know if that's still an important thing. We've talked about yeah, distribution. Nigeria. We've talked about <laughs> now even the artists not necessarily being united. Mm, I feel like the, <sighs> the industry right now is on. Um, what do you call it? Um, self control, self control. Yeah. I mean, uh, Auto, autopilot. Auto, autopilot yeah. eh? And at that point in time, we are exist uh, things are working out in the wrongest ways. So I'm so afraid for organized situation coming in, <laughs> coming in, <laughs> and then making it because you see a lot of our guys going to sign our deals out there, and then when they see how it is, they have to wait till fall. Or wait till summer for one thing to for you to release one single. You be like, ah, I like you. <laughs> <laughs> I know 